Mission is supported by the Star Ghana Foundation with thanks to Danida, UK Aid and the EU. Residents of Mantiwari in the Doma Central Municipality of the Bono region struggle to access health care. Construction of a community-based health planning and services ships compound has been abandoned. Mantiwari is a farming community in the Doma Central Municipality of the Bono region. Residents say their town has been neglected by both past and present government in the delivery of social amenities. Access to health care is a major challenge. Patients, including expectant mothers, trek about 8 kilometers to access care at Abuabo Norma 2. Due to this, most pregnant women do not attend antenatal clinic because of the journey they would have to cover. <laughs> Do I just say about Wabu and some be so I have a form? Yes, I swear you be motor, Tim be our bed. Residents say nurses from the nearest health facility visit the community monthly to undertake child welfare clinic activities only. Apart from rain, no more, my high beam. Did you say one a walk? To be crabbish or town say, blood, just say a big crown to me. This has been the norm for some time now. As the cheapest means of transport, motorbikes are not regular. Residents have to trek. Efia uh, uh. Hana and her colleagues were returning from clinic around 1 p.m. after a long wait without any vehicle to transport them home. The Doma Central Municipal Assembly for years ago commenced its construction of a community-based health planning and services compound to provide primary health care to the people. The project, however, stalled after roofing and plastering works were done. The project, which is about 80% complete, has been left in the bush. Residents believe completion of the project is crucial to their survival. Municipal Chief Executive Drisa Watara said the contractor has no reason for abandoning the site. The Mantiwari Chips Compound is a project that we inherited um, ever since I assume office. So we've honored not less than two certificates from the, for the contractor. So he doesn't have any reason to you know, leave site. We expect him to go back and then finish the, the project for us. For us, what the previous administration started still belongs to the good people of Doma. The money does not belong to anybody. It's public funds. So what we are doing is that uh, all the inherited projects, we are trying hard to complete them. He indicated Mantiwari as one of the communities that has benefited from the Assembly's social intervention programs. Visa Watara is confident of addressing the health needs of the people towards the attainment of the United Nations Sustainable Development Goal 3, which targets ensuring access to quality health care for all by 2030. Still in the Doma Central Municipality, the building accommodating kindergarten pupils of the Chichire Basic School is near collapse. Stanley Nibler reports this is putting the lives of pupils and teachers at risk. Over 200 pupils from eight dispersed communities are enrolled at the Chichire Basic School. Primary one to six pupils study in a decent classroom constructed by the Municipal Assembly less than a decade ago. However, the building has started deteriorating. There are defects in all the classrooms. Fire, Holy Ghost. Kindergarten pupils are confined in a mud structure. Already, the structure has had portions of its roof ripped off. Most of the wood supporting the structure have been eaten by termites. This puts the lives of teachers and pupils in danger, affecting teaching and learning in the process. The Parents Teacher Association put up the structure to accommodate the growing population of the school. It is long term value that uh, the government should have come in to build the permanent shelter for us. So if it is um, windy, you have to close the children to go home because of the, the, the shelter of the um, block. The state of the building residency has reduced the school's enrollment. We are moving from village to village to convince them that uh, sooner or later the government will come and put up uh, a new searcher for us so they should bring them to the school. And even we, we started with a small feeding program which is helping them. We were managing the, the internally 
generated funds to uh, retain the st uh, students in the school. Aside the deplorable state of the school building, furniture in the school is inadequate. A broken bench serves the pupils. The junior high school also has a similar problem. The community said it is willing to support the school but lacks the funds. Municipal Chief Executive for Doma Central, Drisa Watara, said funding remains a major challenge to the provision of infrastructure in the municipality. We have so many cases you know, in the municipality, but in all of this, um, it's a challenge. But we are doing our bit to make sure that we make life comfortable for our people. So it's not only Chichire. Of course, um, if you get the funding, why not? We'll go there to work for our people. That's what we are looking forward to you know, doing. The assembly has, however, provided teachers with a bungalow, hoping to secure funds to address the remaining challenges. The Chichire school, like others, would require stakeholders' commitment to address its challenges. And that's it for Mission. Mission is supported by the Star Ghana Foundation with thanks to Danida, UK Aid and the EU. Thanks so much for watching.